A nation's strength not lie in its ability to strike, but also its ability to defend. Join everyone and respect you to sir. I will choose a topic to give my lecture it on air defense system. I will further divide my lecture it into sub parts: introduction, historical aspects, component of the air defense system, and the challenges and conclusion part. Coming to the introduction part, air defense system refer to the security of the nation by the air, and it play a vital and the provider role. in the safeguard of the country by the air after the post independence india needs a air defense system that is capable to safeguard its country by air because we fought india pakistan war three times 1947 war 1965 war and 1971 war and in the indo china war and 62 war after this war we realized that we need to a robust and good air defense system that we need after that we made a multi layer air defense system that have the capability of the radars missile systems and the low level guns anti air strike guns coming to the component of the air defense system air defense system have the multi layer component system that is various component in the air i'm talking about the first is ground based air defense which is the guns like L70 is old gun but is still used to ground level low aerial threats defending to anti aircraft missile guns and talking about the akash missile system that is surface to air missile it is a very crucial missile for the indian defense system and we also seen such examples in the recent like indo pakistan uh, conflict after the pehlgam attack we have seen that akash missile with the help of the s400 like intercept all the incoming aerial threats which is uv with the accuracy of the 100% and we also said that our indigenous product is how much capable and now i'm talking about the other like component that is the ballistic missiles india has in the few countries which have the ballistic missile air defense interceptors so in the prathvi air defense missile we have that capability to intercept the enemy territory enemy fighter crafts now i'm talking about the fighter interceptors india also have the fighter interceptors like rafale su 30 mki and tejas and the mig 29 which are the capable that we can they can intercept and destroy the enemy missiles and the fighter jet without reaching the indian airspace these are the capability of the indian air defense systems now i'm talking about the challenges and the uh, challenges of the indian air defense system so the upcoming aerial threat that is cyber security or the upgradation of the uavs is a major challenge for the indian air defense because in the upgradation nowadays and the cyber attacks are also having so we have to develop and upgrade our system day by day so that it can perform well and one is also that is the import of the other countries we have to rely on its indigenous product by the initiative of the atmanirbhar bharat so we can produce more systems like akash that are capable enough to destroy the enemy aerial threats and i'm talking about the conclusion part in the conclusion part air defense system provide a vital component of the indian security and the security of the air so we have to depend on the atmanirbhar bharat to produce the air defense uh, equipment to safeguard our country so in the last i would say that air defense system is the only not only the security of the country but is also provide the ability to that we have the capability to defend our country by the air thank you